What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Red Thorns Gaming. You know the game in front of you. It's that time of the week. It's Friday. We got a Fortress Siege. I believe this is number 36 or 37 in the series. I'm starting to lose count, and that is actually a good thing. Now, let's get into what is going on. But before we do that, what is this all about? Okay. Oh, that's a new thing from the update. All right. Roger that. Okay. So... Earlier when I checked this, earlier when I checked this, things looked like there wasn't going to be any any kind of real battle going on. And then I was informed that the, what is it called? The rankings were incorrect. Well, I don't know. Let's see. Ranking. So clan combat power. There's two real fights. Redemption versus somebody. Oh, no, Redemption versus Impact, I believe. And then there's the one that I'm doing, which is Tiny Herb. They went up a little bit, but not a lot. Tiny Herb is actually fighting somebody on page three, Rogue Squad. Rogue Squad hasn't gone up at, at all. I can't see this being much of a fight. I'm not going to do what I normally do with all the red boxes and the CP difference. I was told that possibly these were wrong, and the hard buff just went off, that these numbers were wrong, potentially, and... Honestly, if they are wrong, then this is totally pointless for me to do. Because we're looking at, what, Tiny Herb's got 154. I mean, we're looking at, like, over a 50 million combat power difference between the two clans. Uh, and that's, Tiny Herb's going to crush them if that is the case. Now, if these numbers are wrong, for whatever reason, a bug or whatever, I did delete the game and reinstalled it to get rid of the spectator bug. Apparently, if there's a bug in this, it doesn't fix it. That is a large difference between the two. If Tiny Herb loses this, and these numbers are actually correct, that's going to be pretty embarrassing for Tiny Herb. So, let's see what's going on with the other battle. Okay, so here is the other battle, Impact versus Redemption. And as we saw earlier, uh, Redemption had, what, 213? Impact had 187? That's a little bit closer in terms of the fight, but not that close. Uh, we've seen worse. Not much worse, but we have seen worse. I think Redemption is most likely going to win this battle. Miss Solo is going to not only participate, but also record this battle. Miss Solo right now is in Redemption, so she will be handling this particular Fortress Siege. Mine is down here, Rogue Squad versus Tiny Herb. 1.2 million for B-Grade Fortress. And if the numbers are correct, Tiny Herb paid very little to win this B-Grade Fortress. Let's see, we have 2 minutes and 40 seconds, so let's head in. Okay, I will be back in a minute and a half. And we are back with 90 seconds before this battle begins. No one has come in yet. The Harden buff already went off. I guess everyone's getting food would be my best assessment of what is going on. Tiny Herb is in force down here. Rogue Squad looks like they may not even... I don't know. Oh, I saw their leader. There is Tiny Herb's leader who is running faster than I can go. Livriac? I apologize if I'm saying that word or that name <laughs> incorrectly. But there's their leader, Livriac. Looks like a, I don't know, oh, a sorcerer as a leader. Wow, I have not seen that yet. Let's head on up to Rogue Squad in the blue on the top, the defenders. I will be following Tiny Herb 30 seconds before we begin. I don't even think this is a real fight. I don't think Rogue Squad's going to show up to this. I guess they couldn't get, uh, couldn't get anybody to... Join them 10 seconds before we begin. This is not going to be much of a fight. Five seconds before we begin. And here we go. Rogue Squad versus Tiny Herb. Like where? There is no Rogue Squad here. This is not a battle. Okay, I'm probably going to have to go over to... Because they're going to crush this. this. This is a done deal. There's no there's no Rogue Squad. So I'm going to leave here. And I'm going to head on over to the A-grade fight. Sorry, Miss Solo, but I, I... I mean, nobody wants to see that. 
So impact versus redemption. Redemption taking a lead in the kill death department. Redemption three minutes on an altar imprint. They're going for their 30% buff. They're over halfway. Thirty percent buff for the next two minutes and forty-four seconds. Ah, uh, wow! Redemption taking. The blue team's gate has been destroyed. The blue team's defense tower has been destroyed. There goes an onspawn gate of impact. There is Redemption's leader, Amy Marie. Who's already started to imprint. And there goes this Holy Artifact Defense Tower of Impact. Redemption looks like they are just absolutely crushing Impact right now. And I mean, look at the, the kills. The 154 versus 37. Holy moly. And there's the leader of Impact, Grish. And there goes the spawn gate of Impact Redemption. It's just absolutely curb stopping Impact right now. Both gates are still up for Redemption. Where's the battle at? Oh, it's over here. Are they playing Open Siege? It looks like they are. The red team has started imprinting the but at least they are trying to imprint and win this battle. The red team has failed to imprint the holy artifact. Redemption is just dominating. This is wow. So maybe maybe the numbers were correct. Who knows? 20 kill streak, 15 kill streak. Redemption just totally stopping impact right now. Redemption not doing a very good job of playing open siege and keeping them from getting out of their spawn point. The altar of earth imprinting has been reset. The red team has started imprinting the holy artifact. I mean, this is a done deal right here. Redemption's not going to lose this battle. Should impact take this the distance? Redemption will win by holy artifact imprint time. Thirty percent buff for redemption. At the same time, they got both ten percent. Wow, that is phenomenal right there. This battle is a done deal, ladies and gentlemen. I'm. It, it's all a matter of how long Impact actually wants to drag it out, because they only have 103 kills versus 444 and counting. But Amy Marie doesn't seem to understand the concept of. Let's wait for the rest of my teammates to push back Impact so I can win this battle. The red team has started what is Amy Marie doing?
Amy Marie apparently does not watch my videos. She would have a better understanding. The red team yeah, there she goes, finally. Oh, look at that. Impact took down a, a defensive tower. Two defensive towers. Shame on you, Redemption. There's a lot of red up here. And there's Amy Marie. Surrounded by red. Except for the one blue guy who interrupted her. Amy Marie trying to win this battle. Ten, nine, eight, eight seconds remaining. Stopped. Trying again. Eight seconds remaining. <gasps> well, she got it down to seven instead of eight this time. I think Amy Marie is lagging. That was really weird what I just saw. Try again. But too many blue around her now. And killed. How are we looking over here? Oh, the spawn gate of Redemption has been taken down. Well, this is not going to be the fastest Fortress Siege. Although I think that tiny herb uh, row squad might have been. The red team's gate has been destroyed. The red and there goes the spawn and non-spawn gates of redemption. Big battle going on over here. Or there was. Uh, here they go, trying to keep impact from getting out of their spawn area. Wide open, no Amy Marie. And there she is. Can she do it this time? Eight seconds remaining. Six seconds remaining. <laughs> oh, that is too funny. Every time she tries, she gets one second closer at least. So what are we looking at? Another five tries? Try again. Eight seconds remaining. Nope. Try again. Got it to 10. 20 minutes remaining in this fight. Try again. Oh, she... And interrupted. Try again. Interrupted. Impact is being a thorn in the side of Redemption right now. Redemption approaching 1,000 kills. 
Try again. Eight seconds remaining. Four seconds remaining. And congratulations to Redemption. And congratulations to Galen Squared for taking the number one spot. In fact, wow. Am I seriously looking at one through 25? Let's look at the stats. I don't actually have any kind of synopsis for that battle. I think that was... That was just... An absolute thrashing of impact. Yes, it looks like they took one through 25. Absolute thrashing by Redemption. Lots of dashes on impact side. Whew, okay. Let's see if Tiny Herb is done. Obviously, I believe that they should be. Congratulations to Tiny Herb for winning their B-grade Fortress, and congratulations to Redemption for defeating Impact and taking the A-grade Fortress. Well, boy, that was quick. Let's see. 12 minutes it took for that to happen. That is outstanding. Ladies and gentlemen, wow, I don't even know what to say. I was not expecting any of this to actually go down in the way that it did. But hey, hit me up on Discord. Everything you need to know is in the description below. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you again.